Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, whenever you may be. I am Mezzo9, and welcome to my Mezzanine, where today I'm yet again playing a bit of Binding of Isaac. And I'm going to do my usual, usual practice runs, but today I'm going to do them as, as Mac... There! Fumbling my words all over the place. All over the place. Come on, Mez. Right, yes. Today I'm going to be doing my practice runs as Magdalene, because she is a shit character. With her low speed and low attack damage... I'm going to have to play a lot better to get further without taking damage. So, I'll be a lot more warmed up when I get around to doing my real run as Kane in a minute. Let's try this again. Uh, I'm not going to include that footage from that run. Uh, so, I should tell you that what happened was I came across the Widow on the first floor and she kicked my ass like she always does. So... Yeah, that didn't last very long and is not worth leaving in. Common cold, poison that. Ah, oh, that's a great upgrade. That's one of the best, to be honest. Especially with increased tier rate, but I haven't got that. I want it. That's what I'm saying. I think I might actually have a common cold in real life. I've certainly got a bit of a sore throat, which isn't great when I'm trying to record stuff on a daily basis. There we go. Poisoned him. And he died. Quite quickly. Just adjusting my keyboard. That might actually help. So we've got a couple of rooms left on this side, but I think we've got the secret room here. I should keep exploring first. Oh, no enemies. Brilliant. <coughs> and we've got a key and a heart. Brilliant. Uh, makes up for that damage I took a minute ago that I really shouldn't have. Ah, oh, five coins. Brilliant. I need to stop saying brilliant. That would be brilliant. I may as well check in here because I am Kane with the luck and all that. I was about to say there's the se super secret room, but I'm not going to get into it without dying. But now I'm not going to die because of those blue hearts I just picked up. Oh, this is just the secret room. That's a little odd. It's full of money, which is awesome. And that implies that the secret room would be like there. Yeah. Super secret. Awesome. Pair of pills. Hopefully there's something good. Friends till the end. That's not a bad pill at all. Especially once you know that you've got it. Of course, I can't get bad pills as Kane. But still. It's actually a pretty good pill in my opinion. Despite it being classed as a neutral pill. And we've got some more pills here. Pill, pill, pill. What have we got? Tears up. I did say I wanted that and it's just given me three of them. And a full health that I should have saved. If I'd known that it was a full health, I would have. More tears up. Good, I didn't pick up that key because I didn't want it. More tears up. Look at that rapid fire. And with the poison damage as well, that's just going to kick ass. Because it's going to poison them so often. I need a bomb because I've run out. I'd like to get the key or blue heart, but I needed the bomb more. <clears throat> if I find some more money on this floor, I might come back for one of them. Not sure which. Monstro. Monstro against poison damage. This is going to end quickly. If I can actually get a hidden on them. How am I missing Monstro? It's fucking Monstro. Poison just gradually sapping at his health there. Which is the only thing about him that's remotely tough. He's got a lot of health. But he is by far the easiest boss in the game. Much better than the Widow. Dinner. HP up. Brilliant. Got some high health going on. Well, not really. But for Kane I have. Going to use the other friends to the end now. I saved that because I didn't want to waste the fly that would have um, disappeared between rooms. Was that the 
first floor? Oh, that was an epic first floor. I found the super secret and got a ton of range up and some great upgrades. Wow. I didn't realise that was that floor. I did really well for the first floor. I, I never do well that first floor. I must have really high luck this run. Still got one of my flies left after that. That's pretty awesome. Oh, fuck you. Fuck you with a bit of poison. Yeah. Uh, don't really want to go into any of them right now. I might come back for that trap room because it looks like it's next to the um, secret room. And I might come back for that arena because it's a boss one that usually comes with upgrades. <clears throat> but I probably won't come back for the arena because I don't plan to take that much damage on this floor. You know, unless I've, I'm sure I can heal it back up again afterwards. Maybe a way of teleporting out of that... Oh, it's only going to be Monster or Larry. Neither of whom are any problem if you've got poison. I mean, I've just beaten Monstro, so you know that one's not hard. And it's not double Monstro till later floors. Come on, stand still and stop spitting. Coin, lovely. Saving up for whatever item might be in the shop, if I can even get into the shop. I know what this does now, because I figured it out last time I had it. Uh, when I get down to half a heart, it gives me a free blue heart. Which is just wonderful. Just wonderful. Okay, now I'm pretty sure that the secret room is there. But I'm still going to hold off before going in there. Because getting in there and out will either take one of my bombs, which might not be too bad, because I've got plenty of bombs at the minute. Or it will take all of my blue hearts, which would be so bad, because they're good. <sighs> Three bombs, I'm going to get to one of these chests. Might have some coins in it. <clears throat> Got a heart. That's helpful, actually. That is helpful. Going to see what's in the shop. Almost certain that the um, secret room is next to the damage room now. Ah, oh, half price 9 volt. Score. Although I've not got a space bar item for it to go with yet. Hopefully I'll get one of those soon. No money left. So I'll just head down into here. Yeah, there it is. Let them blow up because I've got to come back through this way. I want to save my bombs. Plus... Oh, 15 coin, awesome. Uh, plus, I want to be on low health so that I can get into the boss fight room and get whatever items in there. I should have waited until after the boss because I could have done a whole no damage floor again and gotten a devil room. And then that would have made everything easier. Squeezy you usually drops a couple of bl blue hearts. So, oh, fuck's sake. Walk right into Monstro as he appears. After all that boasting about taking no damage from Monstro. He got his revenge. He certainly did and he's not going to get it. He's going to get it again. Screw you, Monstro. You're going to die now. One more hit, come on. No? Another hit? There we go. Larry's are no problem. Just poison one of their segments and the rest is just going to drop. Or maybe not. Perhaps this poison that doesn't do as much damage as other poisons. Because like with the um, Bob's Curse poison, that does a ton of damage to him. <clears throat> well, we got the Squeezy upgrade, which is even more tears. Which is just epic when we've got the poison tears. We've got a blue heart out of it. And still managed to get into the um, secret room. And we've got another blue, uh, another red heart back. Just going to check. Uh, no, I've only got two bombs. No keys, so I can't get that chest anyway. Let's take on the boss. Larry, just fought you and kicked your ass. 
you want more? That's fine by me. Whoa. Sneak up on me. How dare you? How very dare you, Larry? You sneaky bugger. Still, rampaged through that. Rotten meat. Bit more HP. No more bombs, no more keys, so down we go. I could have bought both a bomb and a key from the bloody shop. Had the money for it. Come on, Mez. Right. Next room. Oh, crap, this room. Once we release them, they're going to break the shit and send those flies all after me. But if we can trick shot them like that, just right. No, shit. Come on. Get out of there, flies. No! I think this is one of the few rooms where flies actually become a bit of a threat. Partially because of the lack of manoeuvrability. But more because you barely notice them. Over the um, big guys charging about the place. Okay, greed heads. They shouldn't be able to get me. Although sometimes they do actually manage to get out of that block area. Let's try from this side. Um, <clears throat> shit. Ran straight into a bullet. <clears throat> Bomb for a key. I'm not sure about that just yet. I might come across another key. Just in a room or whatever. I've got to clear out some of these flies to actually make it through. can have him poisoned when we break the shit, he's going to go down a lot quicker. Got the spider, that's good. And down with this fly. Uh, I'm going to leave the other two because they're not really in the way. I can dodge around them easily enough. Assuming I remember to, which I won't because I have a crap memory. Maybe I should have killed them. Did I just say shit off? Come on, Mez, you know better than that. Okay, that's a bomb. Level here. Some more greed heads that can't get to me again. We'll take them down with minimal difficultness. Yeah. That's a word. Honest. No drop, come on. It was greed heads. Poison bomb dudes are surrounding me, shit! It's not what you want. But I am tearing through them with my rapid tears and poison. I want to get this one to blow up this blue brick. If we... No, not over there. No, oh, too close to me! Fuck you. At least you gave me a key. And a bit of health. Health back. Okay, that's not too bad. It kind of is, but it's not too bad. I'm not going in there yet, and I'm not picking that up, because I want to save my key for the item room, bonus room, whatever you want to call it. And I have no idea where that is right now. So I've got to do a little bit of exploring. <clears throat> and throat clearing. Oh, here we go. No risk getting to it either. Oh, yeah. Book of Shadows. Defensive shieldy majigger. <clears throat> I'm going to get that heart because I need a bit of healing. But I have now got the Book of Shadows for the boss. And that's going to be really helpful. Uh, I'm going to take that key at this point. Because I want to get into the shop. Because I've got all this money. I don't want to just not spend it. Why skip upgrades when you could not skip upgrades? I mean, come on, guy. Oh. Why? Because it's the notched axe. Which is really not a great upgrade. Not even got a key in here. I'll just buy the bomb and move on. Could always use more bombs. Silly me. 
I need a heart. Bye again, Mr. Crumbly Shopkeeper. So, I'm just going to check for the... Actually, I can check it from in here. Secret room should be there. Might not be, but it is. Good. A little bit more money. Well, that'll do me wonders on the next floor if I ever come across that shop. <clears throat> this boss should not be too tough, whoever it might be. Of course, I might eat my words any moment now. Gertie Jr. He's a toughie. Mostly because I haven't mastered him yet. I, I, I don't always understand where he's going to go and when. See, Gerdy gives more of a warning before he goes on attack, uh, does attacks at all. Gerdy Jr. does not. Making it a keep your distance and keep on dodging sort of manoeuvre. Shit. Didn't even use my Book of Shadows. I really should have. Although, there is something else I can use it for now. I can use it to reduce damage from this trap room over here. If I can actually get through. Maybe they'll have a key in there and I can finally open that chest. Need to remember about that fly when I come in here, otherwise I'm just going to run straight into it. Once again, maybe I should have gotten rid of it. Let's do it going in. Because we might be able to teleport out. With one of those pills. Ooh, blue heart. Lovely. Tears up. And unknown. Let's see what they do. Oh, puberty. Alright then. <clears throat> Still, only half a um, blue heart of damage. That's not bad at all. And we got some tears up for it. Although, I think we've got maximum tears anyway. I don't know. Dodge the fly and head on down to the next floor. That's the plan. Don't forget it. Only got one bomb. No point looking for the se super secret. It's not where I thought it might be anyway. Because I just saw scorch marks on the floor already from what I fought in that room. Oh, still got a bit of coffee. Awesome. Okay, we've got a bit of a combat room up here. Need a key to get that anyway. Might come back for it later. Whoa! Too close. Should keep my distance from these things. Thank you for that. That saves me a bomb. Opening up the secret room for me up there. And I can't get to them. Come on! <clears throat> I need flight. Ooh! Trinket machine. I'm going to use this. Ooh, Joker. I'm going to hang on to that for a minute. The Emperor. I can take the Joker over the Emperor any day. But I still want a trinket like Isaac's Fork. That's a reasonable one, but it's not the one I want. What have they got here? Death. That's a good card, but I'll save that for in a bit. Actually, I probably won't, because I... Not going to really be able to get back in here. Come on. Something good. Alright, I'm just going to take Isaac's fork. Blow this shit up. Before I waste all of my coins. Oh, key. Lovely. <clears throat> now, can I get out without picking anything up? No. There we go. I'm going to save this key for the item room, wherever it might be. Oh shit. Ah, stop running into the tears, Mez! Come on! There we go. Oh. Fuck's sake! There you go. Just strafe a little bit. Get them poisoned. It'll do the job. Then we can heal up all the way. No, not quite all the way. But oh well. Doesn't need to be. And lose my fingering as I move over to get the coin. Yeah, that was a poor choice of phrasing, I know.
Right. Any of you going to actually try anything for once? No? No? Oh, good then. Another key. Might be ready to get that item from the item room in a moment. Might not. Haven't decided yet. Seriously, straight into the spikes. Why? Why would I ever do that? These guys are not the toughest of enemies, but not the easiest either. They take a good few hits to take out. Good thing I've got poison damage, because that really helps with, to be honest, anything that's got high health. Another coin. Always helpful. Let's look for this item room, because it's got to be near here somewhere. I don't want to get it before I use the Joker, because it might be Krampus, and I want to be at my best for Krampus. He's not the easiest of random bosses. By far. Got the key. Not that I can get to it. Down here, then. Blow them right up. That wasn't an issue at all. More money. Helpful when I find the shop. Oh, shop, arcade, and item room all at once, guarded by greed heads. Of course, that's how it's going to happen. So, I guess I'm going to be doing a little bit of gambling in a moment. And hopefully getting something good out of it. Should be, because I've got um, Kane's Luck. More Tears Up pills that I'm pretty sure are still going to have no effect. And into the item room. Kill that fire before it spits on me. Bobby Bomb! More bombs! Great! And they're homing. Uh, yeah, I'll pay a coin to get into the arcade. I can afford to. And I'm going to try and get some more keys out of here. Or at least some healing. Like that, yes, that's perfect. Give me it. Thank you. Yeah, more of it. Awesome. Oh, and from you. Oh, screw you then. This is actually going pretty well. Healing is, is exactly what I needed from in here. And it's giving me plenty of it. Although, I'd like a few coins back now. Shit, it's gonna kill him. Oh, skeleton key. That's also helpful. I'd really like a few coins back now. Right, let's start by blowing this up. Couple of coins back. Healing. And this normally drops some health when it blows up. And I've got plenty of health that I can spare anyway. So I'm just going to use it a couple of times before I kill it. Get the money out. No health. Oh well. Bit of money back from it. May as well go into the shop now that I've got this um, golden key. Which gives me infinite keys for the floor. Or at least makes all the doors and chests and things. Anything that would need a key, or uh, it doesn't cost a key anymore. Not doing particularly well against greed, which is odd, because it's only greed. But I want the coins anyway. Seriously, is that it? Okay. Yes, I am aware that I could have used the Joker in there to escape. But I wanted the coins. And... I also wanted to save the Joker for what I'm about to do now. I can't get in there anymore. I've taken damage. Fuck's sake. Shouldn't swear so much. But this game is a bit like that at moments. Whoa, that was close. Let's take these from the side and slaughter them all. Yeah! Key that's not any use to me on this floor, but it'll be great on the next floor or so. These guys are going to blow the shit out of everything. And these guys are going to spit everywhere. And I'm going to just have to run through <laughs> and somehow not take damage. That was pretty lucky. Of course it was lucky, it's Kane. 
Okay, I see two locations that the super secret room might be in. I think one of them also comes with a key. In fact, now I see three locations. But I'm still going to try up here first. I uh, can't actually get that close enough to both. Oh, yes, yes. Ooh, health. Okay. Now I can get into that room. Into the battle room majigger. And I can unlock that chest for free. And then be sneaky. I, no, I didn't overshoot. It is there. What am I thinking? So open that. Oh, money. Bye-bye. All right, what deals have you got for me today, devil? That is the pact or the mark. I'm going to go with the mark. Damage up. Quite heftily, to be honest. I'm not going to get the pact, because that'll put me down to one heart maximum, which will just be horrible. I am, however, going to go to fight the boss. Because that's all there is left to do on this floor. Other than maybe collect some more keys at the cost of bombs, but I don't need to do that. I've got plenty of keys. Husk, not too bad at all. Let's use my shield, because I haven't actually used that once yet. And just wipe him out. Awesome. Ha! <laughs> that floor was no problem at all. Grab the cat of nine tails and into the devil room, which we already know what's in there. And we already know that we can't really afford it without killing ourselves. I'm not sure why I'm saying we, it's only me playing. Well, down we go. This is going pretty well. 26 minutes, bloody hell. We're only just getting down to here? I need to hurry this a lot. No, I don't need to hurry this. Fuck off! Stop pushing me around, you silly spider! Yeah, I don't need to hurry this along, because it's just going to get me fucking killed! What am I doing? What am I doing? Wow, that recharges really quickly. So oh, good room to use it as well. More greed heads, but they can't do anything to me while I've got my shield up. Oh shit, my shield went down. Should pay more attention to that. Of course it's recharging really quickly because I've got the 9 volt. I should be making best use of this item, honestly. I'm sorry to all of you that might have been infuriated by me not making best use of it so far. Yeah, blow each other up. That's cool by me. Don't blow me up, though. That's not cool by me. Seriously? That was right on the edge there. That should have died. Oh, well. Let's see what's in this shop. Hopefully not greed again. Oh, steam sale. I'll get that. Only one more shop, but still. I might get both of those if I can find the money. Nasty room, but I've seen worse. I might actually be able to no damage this if I do it properly. Okay, we want to get these guys facing that way and then come up here and just barrel into him. And then same again over here. Okay, that didn't quite finish him. There we go. Not going to bother. Oh, I could. If I line myself up properly. Yeah! Coin! Score! Not worth one heart, but certainly worth none. If you get where I'm coming from. Spiders everywhere. That's going to be some dodging. Oh, skills slash luck. Shush. Don't mock my skills. Oh, shit. Okay, put out these fires because they're actually probably a bigger th threat, he says, while getting hit by a spider. It's kind of a lonely run. I haven't got any familiars or orbitals. And it's just me and my wide eyes. <sighs> oh, well. Oh, shit. How, how did that not hurt me? I'm using that. This is a bit of a chaotic room. Oh, 
finish off this one last fly because that's no problem with increased damage and poison damage. What is my damage looking like? Not too bad at all. Two more notches available. Really need some more range though. Okay, this isn't the most pleasant of rooms. But I can get through it. With just a little bit of tactics. And we've got the oh, these crappy things. May as well take them now. Not worth that money. But I think that the secret room might be here. So I'll try that. There we go. As predicted. Also a little bit of money. I think I can get what's in the shop now though. And I think there was some health in there. So I might give that a go. I'll just see what's down here first. I might be able to find some more health and or money. Or lose my health and money. That's that one down. Just keep dodging these um, triple shots and I should be alright. And then the flies are flies since when are they a problem? Bomb for half a heart. Shame I lost half a heart getting into the room. Oh, shit, 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 shit. That was close. That's it. You go that way. Ooh. And then we just need to take down these two, which I'm doing quite poorly. Why have I even got that if I'm not going to use it? And when I'm using it, why am I not hitting anything? I've got Isaac's fork. That's why I picked that up. Random heals every now and then. Oh shit. That's it. Come this way and bump your heads on the spikes. Shit. Gonna have to actually come at this one. Got me, bitch. Right, that there. And we can get the chest and see heart and a coin. Not a heart, key and a coin. Oh shit, ultra pride. This is going to be tough. Upgraded form of pride. Uh, ego and id, as they say. Quite a powerful boss. Mini boss, rather. Home in tears as well, which is never pleasant. But now it's down. Oh, and the left hand has appeared in the basement! Unlocks! And I've got it now as well. That, on a regular basis, turns chests into, um... Red chests. Gold, gold chests included. And red chests aren't, aren't as good. I prefer the gold chests. Although, the red chests sometimes come with guppy items in them, so if you're going for a guppy run, that then it's kind of worth it. I'm not going for a guppy run, so it's not kind of worth it. What is worth it at this point is running back, back to get that heart before I take on another room. Because I am in pain. Kane is in pain. Pain for Kane. There wasn't a heart in here at all, but there was a tarot card. The Magician. That's going to serve me well against the boss. I'd also like to have my shield charged by then. Which will only take one more room, and I can see another room. So I guess we've just got to hope that it's easy. In we go. Well, I wouldn't call that easy. But it's got my blue heart back up, which is kind of cool. Yay for the scapula. Can't get to that. I wish I could. Let's just see what's going on in here. Oh, of course, I haven't got that yet. Glad I didn't take on the boss yet. Why am I saying yet so much yet? Holy water. Okay, I've had worse upgrades. Goes well with the um, scapula in this case as well. I think it spills when I take damage. And that's it. Damage is enemies that walk into the spill. Great. I'm just curious how scapula is going to react to this.
with half a heart left, about to take on a boss and sure that I'm going to lose, I see no better time to pick up the dead cat item. And if I'm wielding the dead cat, oh yeah, that's completely restored my my blue heart. If I'm wielding the dead cat, I see no better time to pick up the left hand item. Because that's going to make more pieces of Guppy appear and give me a chance to actually become Guppy. I'm not aiming for it, but it could happen. So now I'll just head on to face the boss and probably die. But I've got some good stuff prepared. The Magician and the... Oh, fuck. Okay, Magician straight out. Oh yeah, poison damage is going to actually work on this guy. Going to shield. And just charge this heart, which should be dead by now. Okay, now we can just get him poisoned as much as we can. Extra easy now that we've got the magician running. Uh, of course, if I take one more hit, that's just going to restore my... um. Blue heart, unless he hits for full damage, in which case that's really going to hurt. Slash kill me. He's got to be almost dead by now. I mean, he's getting so poisoned. And hit in the back occasionally. And my tears do, da do high damage. Do manage high damage is what I was trying to say. I lost focus on trying to phrase something, so perhaps I should just focus on the fight. When it's one that I hate this much. At least I can take him on from the front for once. <clears throat> Not as effective, but still, the poison helps a lot with that guy. I really hate that boss. That is the boss version of my least favourite enemy. Of course I'm going to hate that boss. <clears throat> I'm not sure what I just picked up. Oh, it was it was range. That's awesome. That's what I really needed. Okay. Nine lives heading down to the depths part two. Where we are going to take on Mum, hopefully. One more upgrade and one more shop on the way there. Let's hope we can get Epic in time. We've already taken him down by quite a lot of health. This rapid fire is really doing a lot of help for me. Helping me a lot. Uh, 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 I don't even care how I'm phrasing things right now. I care too much about winning the battle. And not dying in the process. So... I'm going to just dodge past this because I've got a ton of speed. Didn't even see me. Whack on the shield because this is going to actually not go well for me otherwise. Yeah. And heal up. <clears throat> oh, shit. That's them down. Can't get to that because it's in the middle. Let's head this way then. Oh, shit. I hate these things. They're like the bomb flies, but they actually target you. I mean, how tough do you want to be, silly enemy? I'm not going to do that. Oh, actually, I am going to do that, because all chests are red chests, I think. Oh, maybe not all, but it could be an item, or a big explosion. That's... I really shouldn't have done any of that, should I? Oh, well. We all have to learn somewhere. That we are idiots. Maybe I should have used my shield, but it actually went alright. B D D D dum. And spit me out a heart. Lovely. Give me some health up pills as well. Screw you. Oh, hell no. I am not picking up the tick. Because you can't put it down. It doesn't let you. 
Which is a shame, because it's a pretty good trinket. But I don't want it. And I certainly don't want to be stuck with it for the rest of the run, which might not be very long at this rate. Yeah! Death by poison. Alright, in here. We have got Yannicka's cookbook. I don't want that. That's going to kill me before it kills the enemies. I should have phrased that differently. That's going to kill me before it kills the enemies. Yeah, that's how that should have been. Not phrased, pronounced. Enunciate? Uh, I don't know. Why am I looking for complicated words when I'm trying to fight tough enemies? Shit, being crisscrossed. Ah! Yeah, book of shadows in your face. And now you're going to go down really quickly, and we're done. Need to get that recharged now, but that won't take too long. Just need to dodge these spiders! I'd actually be better off taking one hit at this point. So let's kill one of them, and walk into the other, and then kill it. Ooh, red chest. Bombs! Next room. And... Oh, shit. Fuck off! I'm trying to kill your heart here! Stop knocking me out of the way! There we go. That could have gone a lot better. Um... I might actually come back for that heart. Because if I take half a damage, I'll get my blue heart back. And then I get that heart and I'm back up to reasonable. So, clear out this room. Not entirely, but mostly. Leave one enemy and then let it hit me once and then kill it. Hit me once and it kills you anyway. Awesome. That's also charged up my book. And considering that I might actually end up using it in the next room if I keep trying to explore, I might just head on to fight Mum now. Got no coins, so it's pointless trying to go into that shop. Not got enough bombs to look for the um, super secret room. Ow! It hit me. I do want to go this way though, that's the problem. That's it, you go across there. Okay, I'm not going to bother with that coin, because it's a waste of my only bomb. Is this mum? Am I on that floor yet? Is there a way to check? I've never actually wanted to. I don't know, but I do know that I'm pausing for a moment, because I cannot fight mum while I need the toilet this badly. Alright, here we go, let's take on this boss. Uh, yeah. Just get my fingers back into the positions, you know, make sure I'm on the right keys. Uh, yeah. Have I not got a Q item? Oh well. I'm not going to find one easily, let's just fight mum and get it over with. This isn't going too badly yet. Oh, spoke too soon. Poison damage is really helping already, though. Especially when I managed to hit her in multiple places, because then she's taken multiple loads of um, poison damage. Oh, let's try and get her to break this blue brick. Oh, shit! She just eyed me in the... F I've got eight lives! Nine lives, even. I completely forgot that. But she did just eye me in the face, and that didn't go too well. Right, what I'm going to do, I'm going to head down over this way and take on this last room to charge up my um, Book of Shadows. And maybe even my um, scapula to get that extra half a heart. Just like that. But not just like that. Okay. What's these pills? What do they do? Balls of steel. Awesome. Book's not charged though. 
kind of needs to be. All right, what have we got? We've got a combat room down there. We've got a machine in the middle that we can't get to without taking damage. We've got a damage room on the right that I'm certainly not going into. Let's see what's in the combat room. Of course it's a red chest. I'll come back for that in a moment. And hope for a worthwhile guppy item. In the meantime, spiders, no problem. And a bit of money, so it might make it worth going into the shop. I've got a steam sale after all. So yeah, it will make it worth going into the shop, because that's ten coins, which is more than I could want right now. Ah, that's not possible oh, damage, is it? We're through there. Oh shit! Right, let's do this. Get rid of them. Grab these coins and get out of here. Oh shit, I want to blow the... Uh, uh, oh, I've got to blow it up, I need to get those hearts. Ooh, that was a bit hard to dodge anyway. That wasn't going to be dodged. Full health pills. Not really that much use when I've only got one max heart. Got a few attack flies. That's not going to last long. I needed to come in here to help recharge the item. That I should have used before the room ran out last room. Because then it would actually be recharged. Oh shit, it's not going to be recharged in time. Okay. These guys are the ones that I've got a problem with. Uh, I suppose these are the ones that everyone's got a problem with. But they're not that tough if you've got enough speed. These guys are really quite easy if you've got poison damage. Because the poison damage can pretty much wipe out the lumps on the floor if you get them poisoned. There we go. And... Yeah, head up to the shop. There's not a lot of other choice, really. Has narrowed down the uh, possible places for the super secret room, but I've not got any bombs left now. Greed! What are you doing here? Other than helping me get my um, item fully charged. No, you don't, spider. Oh, shit! Up against a wall there. It wasn't helpful. Great! A ton of money that I can't ever use! Damn you, game. Damn you! Damn you! I'm sorry, is that brick inside a wall? That's odd. It's not something I've seen before. That's for sure. Right. Let's go in here. Because that's just going to regenerate my blue heart. But it didn't give me anything useful. Which is a shame. And... There's a heart somewhere around the... near the sacrifice room. Okay. Might it be worth going in the sacrifice room? I mean, I'll just get the blue heart back from Scapula. Right? I'm going to give it a go. Nothing. But I got the blue heart back, so it's fine. And there's a random half a heart on the floor that I haven't picked up sooner. Why not? Okay. No point picking up that coin. I've got no use for coins at this point. But is... One, two, three... Fuck's sake. Four places that the super secret room could be. Can't check any of them. Because I've got no bombs. Here we go. Never try against mum. Poison straight off the bat, always helpful. Oh shit. Need to pay attention to the other enemies a little bit more. Oh, that nearly hit me. Lovely, she thinks she... Oh shit, she actually hit me there though. 
Right, so I uh, don't really want to get hit by her at all because there's a full heart of damage and that's going to make these pills worthless. I'm going to go straight in for another try. God, chain fighting mum. This is interesting. I don't have a bomb to put there. I need to get her to stomp on it, really. Blue block is going to be helpful because it's going to drop me a heart, yay! Oh, no you don't. Let's clear out these enemies, because they get a bit too much if you leave them. And I'm getting alright at dodging mum. <clears throat> no, you don't. You can tell where she's going to put her foot by the shadow. You can tell when she's going to stomp, because she makes a grunt. Makes it quite a bit easier once you know what you're doing. Oh, she nearly got me then still. Yeah. Bring it, bitch. You're not even going to hit me once this time. Oh, no, but I am going to run into your foot. Ever intent on proving me wrong, Mum? I did take that hit on purpose, by the way, to get my blue heart back, and I can just reheal that with my full. Fuck you! I'm not sure how that didn't damage me. Oh, So fucking close. Swearing a lot as well. By which you can tell how into it I am. So this fight might be a little silent this time, because I'm really going to want to focus. Get myself in my chair properly as well. That'll help. If you're really good, you can make a step on herself. Or slap you in the face and kill you. Okay, what can I do to get my... I uh, can't really. Can't really do anything to get my scapula working. Except maybe take a hit during this fight at some point. But I shouldn't do it intentionally. I should just make sure it's not from mum. Ah, like that. <clears throat> Seriously, I know that the foot comes down in the middle the first time. How did I not... How, why did I just walk into it? Okay, we've got a spitty head. That's not going to be too hard. This would be so much easier with piercing tears, you know. Because none of the enemies would be an issue. I'll walk straight into her again. So I need to stay away from the doors. Two lives left. Oh, this is almost torture. Killed over and over and over again. By the same boss. Okay, this shouldn't be too bad. Shit, what hit me? Oh, that guy. See, this is the problem with this fight. There's often too much to focus on. I'm just trying to focus on staying alive now. Any hits I get in against Mum are an extra chance to poison her, so it's all a bit of a help. And the poison does a lot of damage if I get it in the right spot. And I'm trying to keep the room clear of other enemies, because they're actually as big a threat as the foot is. I can dodge mum quite easily. The other enemies just add that extra level of distraction that's too much. Especially when they're shooting enemies like that! I need to keep moving, but I need to stay away from the doors, because otherwise she'll slap me again. Them down. Like, that one's the bigger threat. Oh! 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 Oh, yes! Oh, yes!
told, my lord, I love you above all else, Isaac's mother repeated to herself. This was the end of the line for Isaac. His mother was far too strong for him. But just as he accepted his fate, God intervened, sending an angel down from above to stop his mother's hand. And just like that, it was over. I did it! I beat Mum! And I unlocked the first ending! Yeah, first ending. Now the game tags on a couple of levels at the end, adding to the replayability a bit for one thing, but also it chucks in new bosses, new items, new stuff for the first few floors, such as the Four Horsemen, which can be quite tough, mostly because they actually need a bit more strategy than a lot of the early bosses. Get all the um, monster names now. I've still never seen that one. The 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 blob thing, like a mini monster by the looks of it. Goes through all the bosses as well. Because not all the bosses, because it doesn't go through any of the um, wrath of the lamb stuff. I don't think it does anyway. And Isaac. So that is it. We have beaten them course we still need to um, beat mum's heart and Sheol and the cathedral and if I get that far ever the chest. God, it's been a long time since I've done the chest. Not since they made the um, Polaroid less frequent but that's not going to make any sense to you just yet. I've got to beat mum's heart ten times before I unlock the po Polaroid. Yeah. So, I hope you've all enjoyed this kind of special episode now of Mez Plays the Binding of Isaac. I hope you've enjoyed watching me beat Mum. As always, leave your comments below if there was anything I got wrong or didn't really realise. Uh, I've just noticed that I'm going to have to actually go through it and figure out the item list from watching the entire playthrough. That's going to take a while because it's not got any readout at the end, so I've got to kind of make sure I don't miss anything as well. Oh well. As I was saying, uh, if you enjoyed it, give me a like, give me a favourite. It was the episode where I beat Mum, after all, I think that deserves a like or two. And uh, comment if you um, want to let me know of anything I missed or did wrong, or just to comment on my strategies. And I'll see you all next time, where we will be trying to get even further. And I think I can now unlock some of these other characters, Judas and Samson. I can't remember how to unlock Judas. But I'll figure it out for next time. And we'll see who we can unlock. See you all next time, and we'll do all of that. Until then... Bye.